Hello folks, Tim Oscar here from Stonebeck Games, here with a very quick uh, speed run of my game, The Lighthouse Keeper's Treasure. Uh, this is a very simple uh, exploration puzzle game. But first, we've got to answer a couple of questions. My first name is Tim. It's not my birthday today. And I do know what I'm doing. I made the game. So, dear Tim, welcome to my island. I know it's short notice, but I've had to pop out for a bit. Would you mind terribly if you could look after my treasure for me while I'm gone? I've left instructions for how to find it somewhere about the place. At least I think I did. Anyway, I'll be back soon. And then we can have a nice sit down and a cup of tea. Yours faithfully, the lighthouse keeper. Okie dokie then. I guess we uh, we better see if we can find this treasurer. So, for the sake of the video I'm going to sprint through the whole thing. Use the uh, sprint key which is on uh, shift. Don't mention that in these instructions because I'm expecting most people to take their time over the game rather than run through it like I'm doing. Okay, so first part of the puzzle, we have a treasure map and it looks like the treasure is directly south of where I am now so I've now got a handy compass that's just popped up so let's head south. Uh, what's here? Here we go! It's not going to be as simple as that. The chest sounds like it's locked. Okay, so well, now it's turning night time very quickly. Okay, looks like we've now got a trail of lights to follow up into the jungle. See where these lead us. So for those interested, I made the, uh, the mesh for the island in World Machine exported it as an FBX which I then imported into Unity as um, a low poly mesh rather than a Unity terrain gives me the uh, the low poly texture there rather than the sort of smoother effect that you get with the terrain the trees were all purchased from uh, the Unity asset store as part of an asset pack, a low poly asset pack but I made the lighthouse myself because that didn't come with the asset pack. Okay, next part of the puzzle. Got a riddle. Um, I long to open up the chest, but in the dark is where I rest. Face 30 west and 90 south, then turn around to see the mouth. I'm made of brass, and this you'll see, I'll fit just right if you find me. Okay, well that's clearly uh, in reference to the key, so let's head west, 30 paces. So if you're walking at a sensible pace, you'd know that that was 30 paces if you were counting the footsteps. Now we're going to head 90 south or thereabouts. So this game was intended as a bit of an experiment, a very short game. Most people should be able to finish it in about 10 minutes to maybe half an hour, depending on how much they explore. Here we go, key inside the mouth of a cave. Right now, let's head back towards the, the treasure chest, see if we can open it now. So the idea being that you send this game to maybe family members or friends who've uh, got a birthday or something like that coming up. And uh, it's intended as a bit of an alternative to a greetings card. So when you get to the end of the game, which should be about now, we can now open up the chest. We get a special message. If it was, if it, if I'd answered yes to it being my birthday, it would say happy birthday. Obviously, if it was Christmas, it would say Merry Christmas. But it's just a standard Wednesday, so it just says Happy Wednesday. That's the end of the game. I'll just throw up the uh, credits one more time. I hope you enjoyed watching that video. And if you're interested in uh, in playing this or any other of my other games, head over to itch.io and look for the Lighthouse Keeper's Treasure. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that.